everybody welcome back to screen stars well um, I've been playing Conan Exiles now since it was released last week on the PlayStation 4 I've already put up a couple of videos the first video was my first hour gameplay um, which shows the very basics of me getting to grips with the game very early on the second video that I put up was a tutorial on how to get started if you're a beginner now I've also been thinking and I've had a couple of requests to do an even simpler guides. So what I've decided to do is break the guides down into small sections. And today the guide I'm going to focus on is how to hunt and how to feed yourself, how to eat, how to cook. Now the first thing you're going to need when it comes to this, and this is really intimidating to a lot of people is certainly this menu here the feats section when you're new to the game it's really um, confusing however even to the point where maybe you just you don't know how you even level up or what you do with the points well the first thing, and I have covered this on a previous video, your unspent points. You can see there, unspent points, I don't have any at the minute. Now, when you level up, you'll get unspent points, and you could spend them on this menu here. And I suggest you focus on what I've focused on there, early on in the game. Strength, vitality, encumbrance, um, and survival. Now, at the survival, we'll move down. That shows you um, a survival, if you look on the right hand side, survival is a measure of your ability to live in the harsh conditions. It affects how easily you metabol metabolize food. Um, so that will increase how long it takes for you to eat, uh, before you need to eat and drink, etc. Encumbrance, how much you can carry, it speaks for itself. That The more you put in that, the more you'll be able to carry. Vitality. Um, your health pool, so what, how long your life is, um, when you're in battle and stuff, you'll live longer. And strength, um, how powerful your attacks are against enemies. Now, if you move on to feats, what you're going to need for eating is you're going to need survival. Okay? You see there, I've moved down to survival. If you look on the right hand side, level 1, survivalist. Okay? Um, and once you've clicked on that survivalist, it will allow you to build all those things you see in that menu there. Okay, water skin, torch, bedroll, twine. Okay, if you look at survival on the left hand side again, if you move along, okay, all these things you can get in the survival. Teaches the campfire, you are going to need a campfire to cook, okay. So make sure you put points in the survival thing. And the easiest way, let me just show you. Okay, you see this? Survivalist, there we are. If you go right to the end, the very, very final category, okay, it lists everything. Now early on, this is what I used because I found it all a bit confusing. When you level up and you get unspent points, you can see there, level, I'm level 22 at the minute, I've got one point to spend, I've already spent 78. But early on, you can see all these things, the first thing it lets you unlock is basically um, the sealed water skin thing. And it shows you there on the right hand side, when, you, when you've unlocked that, what that teaches. Okay, when you get unspent points uh, on feats, on the feats, as soon as you are able, okay, unlock campfire okay it only costs one it's dead easy to unlock okay so don't worry about all these other menus over here because they're confusing scroll along using right one until you get to this one here where it's got them all listed it's the easiest one to follow when you're new to the game and when you level up and you level up by doing it anything in the game picking up things chopping things down running walking early on in the game you level up very very easily and very very quickly so you can unlock all this top row within the first 15 20 minutes of playing the game half an hour tops 
an hour depending on how slowly or quickly you play the game okay and all these things at the top you need early on in the game you need you need the sealed water skin to drink you need that so that you can obviously get your first level of clothing you need your wooden box for storage you need your stone pick your stone hatchet for chopping things down you need apprentice mason it's only a cost one and that will allow you to build your first uh, hut shed home whatever you want to call it campfire bed sword hunting bow shield all these top ones you can unlock very very quickly early on it's not difficult but this is a t this is a, a tutorial on how to cook and eat so this is the one you want to be unlocking campfire okay now what do we need for the campfire let's have a look this is the other menu the main one you move along to the right this one on here and you move down to find the campfire take me a while because obviously you can see I've unlocked quite a lot already where is it there we are campfire right you need five branch and 12 stone very very easy I've already got them in the inventory but I'm going to show you how to get them again okay find a tree remember if you use your axe on a tree you get branches there we go you see you do that until you've got five branches in your inventory see that I'm getting wood and branch wood wood branch 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 okay so that's how you get your branch and we already know you get your pick out and that's how you get your stone so what do we need again for the campfire five ranch 12 stone very very simple and then you click X to craft it see at the bottom it's crafted right now it's gone over it's already gone directly in there okay so you've got your campfire now what I'm going to show you because it might might confuse you I'm gonna I'm gonna put it in this menu to show you how you get it from there right so it's gone in this menu here click X oh, hang on click X to highlight it this is PlayStation 4 guide by the way remember click left one that brings up your radial menu move it to the slot you want it to go in click X come out of that menu you see it's there highlight it let go there it is okay this is the campfire place it by clicking right one okay that's the first stage done that's your campfire let's have a look at it there's nothing in it right now okay don't worry about the thrall bit that's just a slave that you can capture to to do the cooking for you later on in the game so what we need now is we need wood for cooking on the fire and some meat so let's go and get the meat now we've already got the wood because we've been chopping down trees so you click on the wood you put it in first okay put your wood in first we've got 50 wood in the campfire now so let's go and get something to eat let's go and find something to eat now you can you can you can cook human flesh if you want, but let's not be disgusting. Let's find something, you know, a bit more edible to eat. Eh? Now there's a little turtley thing down here. These sometimes give you some nice meat. That's the out of stamina. Right, so you go up to it with your axe. Right, we've got some feral flesh in a bone. Come on. Oh, it's a sneaky one, this one, isn't it? 
Got some hide off that one. More feral flesh. I want bigger meat, so we're going to find something bigger to kill. Watch out! Okay, let's kill these first. Die! Yeah, there we go. You can see I've got my Conan sword I crafted. Makes life a lot easier. No, there's nothing of interest on him, and there's nothing of interest on him. So I'll just give you an example here. If you chop them up, you'll get human flesh, severed legs, things like that. You can cook them as well, but I'm not going to do that. Well, I've just eaten something I shouldn't have done. That's giving me food poisoning. I did that by mistake. As this is what something we should get something nice to eat of. Oh, a lot of them. There we go. Should get some nice meat off savory flesh. That's what you want. Got lots of savory flesh off these. There we go. Right, now it's starting to get dark, so let's head back. And I'll show you how to cook these before it gets dark. Which is typical. It's getting dark. Right, so you saw how we built the campfire. Go up to your campfire. Click square. Right, find your savoury flesh. Yeah, click on it, X, highlight it, take it over, put it directly next to the meat. And this is important because it took me a while to figure it out. You click left two on your controller. Left two. It's cooking. Meat. There you go. And it's cooking nice fresh meat for you. And as long as you've got wood, you can see there at the top, because you've got 48 wood in there, that would keep burning for 8 minutes if you had 8 minutes worth of meat to cook. Let's put the meat there, it'll hold 50 at once. Now if you just wanted to camp, keep the campfire going, you could just click left 2 and it'll cook for eight, it'll for burn for 8 minutes even though there's no meat cooking. So it's a good way to get a saucer light in a hut as well, if you want to just fill it with wood and just turn it on. Okay, so that's it, that's it, I've got 50 meat now, even though um, I didn't cook 50 meat, but I've got some more left, see that, I'm just going to stop the campfire. So let's go in my home here, get my torch on. So, that is how, the very basics of eating, okay. You must remember as well, when you, whenever you're picking up things from bushes, you will pick up handfuls of insects. Those are a good way of getting a little bit of um, health back. Until you, until you build your camp fire. Drinking is very, very easy. I'll show you that. Okay, once you've... Let's have a look. So once you've crafted, you can see there, the sealed water skin, yeah, equip it in there, you just step in water, okay, you can't see that because it's dark, and then you just highlight that, and it'll fill up. can't see that because it was dark but it's, you just walk into water and fill up it fill it back up or click square to take a drink directly from the water that's it eating drinking very very simple the meat as well is it quite it keeps fresh for quite a while um, you can see there 
the grilled steak that I've got, if you look right at the bottom of that menu, it says it expires in three hours and 17 minutes. Now that's game time, so if I shut the game down now and turned it back on uh, tomorrow, that will still say three hours 17. It's not real time, it's game time. So you can go out questing for three hours and 17 minutes with all that meat and you'll be fine for three hours and 17 minutes. You won't need to cook anything else, okay? So that's how you cook meat, but you can also eat things like eggs that you find lying about. They give some nutrition too. Any humans that you kill, you can cook all the human flesh, severed legs, if you want to do all that sort of stuff. Okay? So there you go. That is the first basic tutorial for you guys. And that is how to hunt and how to cook. Build a campfire and cook your meat. I hope it's been useful, guys. Please let me know in the comments if there's other tutorials you want. Um, and I will try and facilitate. Thanks for watching.